As the world battles COVID-19, another global epidemic continues to devastate families and communities. It's also airborne and primarily affects the lungs. But unlike COVID-19, this centuries-old infectious disease has yet to ignite a vaccine race, though maybe it should. It's called tuberculosis, or TB. 1.5 million people die per annum because of tuberculosis. So it's a global public health threat. It's airborne, I mean, you can just be passing by, you can just breathe in. It doesn't choose who you are away from, it just affects in. 10 million people become sick with TB globally each year. This enormous disease burden impacts all areas of society. While vaccines are one of the most effective public health interventions to prevent disease, the only licensed vaccine to prevent TB is 100 years old and is inadequate to stop the global TB epidemic. The vaccine is only given to children, it's not effective in adult diseases, and so we need a new vaccine as of yesterday. There hasn't been the governmental support, the research support, or the funding support for us to have to deal with something that has been part of our medical landscape for much too long. In recent years, investment in TB vaccine research and development was less than 20% of the funding required. People sick with TB face challenges that go beyond the medical aspects. For someone like me, who was diagnosed with tuberculosis that was even non-infectious in my womb, people are still afraid to, to come near you. All I did was breathe. How am I stigmatized for doing something that I absolutely must do? Drug-resistant TB still carries a heavy burden of stigma, but also attached with the burden of frequent doctor visits, complications of drugs. Uh, just your lifestyle is so affected by this. Imagine having TB for two years, meaning you can't go to school, you can't go to work, your life is actually at standstill. Given the devastating impact this disease has had for centuries, imagine what a TB-free world might look like. If we become a world where there is no stigmatization because of TB, it would be a world without children losing both of their parents because of TB, where people don't have to worry when it comes to TB about what will happen to their children once they are gone. A vaccine would be protecting your healthcare workers on the front line for the next pandemic. A world without TB would mean you don't have any drug resistance to TB, where you don't have to take these drugs that have severe effects on your outcome. A world without TB should be non-negotiable. A vaccine for TB will be a huge game changer. All the effects of TB on the economy and social life of people, that money will be used elsewhere. It will bring a totally new world altogether. An effective TB vaccine is essential to the goal of a world free of TB. And recent scientific breakthroughs have shown us that developing a new TB vaccine is possible. I do believe the TB vaccine is feasible. We have a lot more tools at our disposal than we had many years ago. We have amazing scientists, but we don't have the public research funds and resources to take this all the way. Accelerating progress to develop new TB vaccines will require collaboration and support at the community, regional, national and global levels. We are links in the same chain. And if you breathe and I breathe, you have a responsibility. I was willing to do the study and give out my baby's blood samples so maybe one day can also help someone else also in the same problem. I thought it was a good uh, opportunity to do something good for the community, to give back even in the smallest way possible. We do need public research funding, we do need Big Pharma to be invested, and we do need a global financing mechanism to ensure that the best scientists are attracted to TB vaccine development in order to get a solution. A TB-free world will become possible if 
lawmakers, governments, researchers, academics, communities, activists, everybody knows that our biggest focus should be ending on this preventable disease called TB. COVID-19 has taught us what we can do. We've learned how to mobilize and change this planet. Imagine what we can achieve when we work together for TB.